In a recent interview on Jimmy Kimmel Live, Qui-Gon Jinn himself, Liam Neeson, denied any involvement with the upcoming Obi-Wan Kenobi prequel series. So I think to many fans, this is going to be somewhat of a disappointment. Many people were hoping that Liam Neeson would be coming back as Qui-Gon Jinn and possibly appear in ghost form to mentor Obi-Wan Kenobi. And originally, when the series was first announced, there was heavy rumors that the series would be more about just Obi-Wan in the desert and possibly going to one or two planets and really about him mastering his skill. At that time, rumors ran rampant that we would see Liam Neeson in that iteration, but that was all scrapped in a favor of going in a different direction with the series. So recently he said, yes, he's heard about the rumors, but there's nothing there. He doesn't think he's in it, he hasn't been approached, and he's not involved. Two ways to look at this. One, he's lying because he wants it to be a surprise, which could very well be the case. Again, we just don't know. Two, he's not in it at all, which I think is the one. And I'm going to combine that with the third possibility. And this is the one I'm like the most convinced it's probably going to be. He's in the series as only a voiceover, talking from beyond. You know, one with the Force and all that, and he's going to communicate with Obi-Wan, but he's not going to have a presence. And I think that would honestly be the best way to handle it, just because we don't need to add more stuff to this series, which already feels like it's loaded at this point with Inquisitors and Darth Vader and teases of young Luke possibly and everything so let's not overload it and try to focus on a standalone story that deals with Obi-Wan and include some references and call outs and possibly even a force ghost voice but not really have him show up in person to me it just doesn't really feel like it needs to be in there I mean they could always change plans as the series continues to shoot who knows but I guess we'll just wait and see